Check this out. There's no single thing we could measure about you that would tell us more than your metabolic rate. Bye, Zane. So in a metabolic chamber, what we can do is we can have someone live in that room, it's like a little dorm room, and we can have them go through a series of, of tasks that might mimic what they do in a normal day. Your metabolic rate is all of your body systems uh, working and burning energy, and so we can capture all of that by measuring the oxygen you consume and the CO2 that you exhale, and use that to measure how many calories you're burning each minute. So this is, we call this the snowflake, and it's pulling air in from all around the room, as you can see, and bringing it out there to be measured. Okay, so air comes into the room here, in this big pipe, and that's our source of fresh air, where we're constantly sampling the air that comes in. Here is bringing the air out of the room. When the air that goes, comes back out, uh, gets measured with this bank of instruments here, and we can compare them, the air that goes in and the air that comes out to figure out what's happening in the room. Uh, metabolic chambers are really special pieces of equipment. There's probably a dozen or so of them in the country. Um, a lot of them are in medical, uh, you know, medical departments, and so they're sort of oriented towards uh, medical research. And we'll do that here, uh, but because we're in an evolutionary anthropology department, we're actually able to sort of do a wider range of uh, experiments as well. So we, we hope it'll get a lot of use in a really wide range of studies.